And she's so precious to us, isn't she? Oh, I love Our, how you did that transition. It's so weird to, to call her a guest. <laughs> she's a friend. She's a superstar. She's part of the ABC family for the past 10 years. You know her name. You know the face. Correspondent anchor Lindsay Davis here, who's also an author now, uh, here to tell us about her new children's book she's written. It is called Stay This Way Forever. Oh, please welcome Emmy Award winner and best-selling author Lindsay Davis. Thank you for being with us. And this is... I want to put this above my scripts. <laughs> not just your first, not just your, this is your third, third children's book. book. Why have you turned to becoming a children's book author from being, you know, an Emmy Award winning journalist? You know what? Initially, it started out that it was just going to be a one off, right? And something that I wanted to kind of communicate and instill in my son, and he continues to be kind of amused. <laughs> and I read this essay years ago that talked about what children's books need, and it said that they need mirrors, windows, and sliding glass doors. So initially, it was the idea of this mirror so that my son could have something that he would see himself reflected in the page of children's books. But lately, it's become the, the focus on the window so that other children will be able to peer into a world that perhaps is unfamiliar to their own. And in general, this idea that parents need to have these diverse book collections for their children. And, you know, while my characters are black and brown characters, I hope that people don't see that as they are for just black and brown children. I think that especially coming off of the summer protests and the so-called racial reckoning, the parents are really starting to see the need. Expose your kids. If you're not being able to give them these experiences and their environment and day-to-day, -day, start out with toys and books. And third book, like you said, do they all tie together? Is it considered as a series now? <laughs> You know what? When's it's, the fourth uh, and fifth coming out? I mean, like. Well, one constant theme is the idea of love. The mm -hmm. first one was kind of that the God loves you. The second one was that we need to love each other. And this one is really about know that you are loved. This is really a love letter from parents to our children. Yeah, I have an 18-year-old and a 14-year-old. So, yes, hold on dearly oh, yes. to that optimism and that enthusiasm because it is important to remember that childlike feeling we have and as parents to see that as well. I know that you're a proud mom and your son is very proud of you and he has a spe special message for you. Take a look. Hi, Mommy. Oh, Thank God. you for writing this book. It teaches me a lot. It also shows me how much you love me. I love you too. See you soon. Oh my oh. goodness, you oh guys goodness. surprised me. Leave that to him when he's 18. <laughs> oh. What do you hope all children take away from this? <laughs> you know, I hope that they know that they are loved, that they're cherished, and I think that it should serve, and I hope that it'll serve as kind of this affirmation when parents are reading this to their children, to talk about, you know, all those things, you know, the, the joys of this moment, and just to, to hold on to this for as long as you can. You know, my son still skips, and I feel like at some point as adults, we stop skipping, you know? We lose that kind of joy. What year was way, that? Right? When do we stop? <laughs> do you skip? You still no, skip? I still skip. No, who skips? I skip. <laughs> really? Yeah. You don't skip. I, I skip all the time. Yeah. <laughs> you skip out of here on Fridays. <laughs> <laughs> Lindsay, thank you so much. This is a beautiful, beautiful book thank for you. all of us to share. Thank you. And stay this way forever goes on sale Tuesday, February 23rd, wherever books are sold. Come back. I really? you are having me. I feel like it's family. Exploded. Just, you know, it's going to be hard to get me out of here. Nice to see you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.